Nobody respects me. I, I haven't done anything cool. I'm always stuck in this stupid office. I'm gonna rustle around in their papers. <laughs> I'm gonna rub my ass all over their files. Eh, <laughs> eh. Yeah, how you like how fuck? you like that? How you like that? I'm gonna sit here and dance for a while. I'm gonna do a shuffle. Okay, I should get to work. <laughs> Where could they be? Alright, we get to lock on our particle can again. Oh, it's gonna be harder this time because there's no roads in Iraq. None. Zero roads in Iraq. Yeah, I think he's on a road. No, it's all desert. Where'd he go? 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 Oh, there he is. Shit. Don't lose him! Shit! Oh, 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 oh
Left when he goes bit. in a straightaway, that's that's the good sign. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. No! Oh. Yes! Yeah, yeah, man! <sighs> yes! Give me some. Fuck off, dude. Boss, give me a fucking raise. Hey, that was pretty hard, actually. I know, right? <laughs> you see what oh I have to go God. through? You see what I have to go through? <laughs> oh, good job. You caught the bad guy. Give me a, like, ten calf pal, then. Welcome back, Doctor. I'm not telling you anything. Bullshit! We know what you were doing out there, in that bloodstained concrete torture box. How do you know it wasn't anything. menstruation? Uh, well, actually, good idea. As doctors, we took an oath to protect human life and limit suffering. I understand that sometimes those two goals conflict with each other. You have no idea what you're talking about. No. This is uh, a war zone, Dr. Mallard. Not some comfortable morgue in Washington, D.C. Things uh, work differently here. I have spent more than my fair share of time in a war zone, Dr. Marx. And I once watched a man tortured to the brink of death repeatedly. Wait, the same man or different to keep him man? alive so that his tormentor Probably could extend his suffering. Because it'd be kind of fucked up to see the same man almost brought to death every single day. Life. Much as I suspect you did for the victims out at that dreadful facility. You have your and then Gibbs on. is like, well, yeah, but my wife and kid died. You oh, oh my shit. god! Aren't you paying warehouse. attention, son? No! no never! <laughs> never! It's not good enough. I would never intentionally inflict suffering on another human being. And I'll kill anyone who says different! Then why were you running, son? Alright, so thyroid cancer, Husker has your head... That's not what I need. Uh, oh, right there! That has to do with her. What about the succino choline? What? what? Why would you have succino choline then? What about this? Okay. Saw the inside of your warehouse. We know what you and Husker were doing out there. That's what Husker was doing, not he her. He ordered me. Right. He made me inject them with sodium pentothal so they wouldn't resist his questions. Then he ordered me to nurse them back to health, <laughs> just as Dr. Meller described from his own experiences. He wanted to extend their pain. Really, but it's I quite a lovely practice, anyone. but uh, I try not to feel Captain good about Husker. it because it makes me feel like a I monster. I did as I was ordered. I eased their pain, reduced their suffering as best I could. The Who best way I can think of to end the suffering Iraqi is BANG! Mostly. Bullshit! Need something more specific. <laughs> they were all Iraqi Okay, fuck. People he picked up off the street who he suspected as having ties to terrorists. So you killed them? I tried There's to so many Muslim them. people in Iraq! Help them. I didn't kill them. I, I did as I was ordered. I eased their pain, reduced their suffering as best I could. You just Bang! Said that, bitch. Ease their suffering. Uh, I think this is where the vial comes in. Right. Yeah. It's a fucking better. Yeah. We also found the succinylcholine. Succinylcholine. He was inflicting terrible, unspeakable things. I couldn't let him keep doing that. Not to anyone. So I injected the succinylcholine instead of the sodium pentothal. But he found out. So yeah, I killed him instead of not killing him. So you them. killed him, too. <laughs> yes, he found out. But no, I didn't kill him. Nine of my fingers have blood on, have blood on them, Gibbs. My pinky is still safe. All right, I, I didn't kill him. Let's see. Du -du -du. But it was the succinylcholine that killed him, remember? So the... No. Wait, where's the the injection mark? Injection mark. No, maybe that didn't have. Nuclear radiation head. What, what could it be? I guess this. It maybe uh, I already did that. Well, I guess I'll be on my oh way. Oh god, we're gonna have to do that all over again. Ah. Welcome back, Doctor. I'm not telling you anything. We know what you were doing. Blood mashing isn't gonna help. In that bloodstained concrete torture the victims out at that dreadful facility. You have your facts wrong. You Why have your you facts wrong. Them? I am a doctor. I save lives and end suffering. End of story. You were torturing people <laughs> at that warehouse. He ordered me. He made me inject them with sodium pentothal so they, they wouldn't move resist her his eyebrows questions. to give her some emotion. Then he ordered and me then, to and then they lock right back to, back to the default position. Just as Dr. Mallard uh -huh. described from his own experiences. 
He it's, wanted it, to it's like even when they try, they fail. But I never tortured anyone. anyone. So I injected the succinylcholine instead of the sodium pentothal. It's like the but actors don't know how to out. say it because they always take yes, a break after out, saying but no, succinylcholine. I him. Succinylcholine. 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 Easy. But I didn't kill him. Duh, duh, duh. Maybe it's the cancer. Nope. Way to go. What could it be then? How about the head wound? The head wound. I don't think that's it. But she said, I just did the succinylcholine. That was it. Oh, yeah, we'll explain his head wound. You better be right. I hope it is. Ah! <laughs> Son <of a> bitch. <laughs> Sorry. Welcome back, doctor. Welcome back, I'm doctor. I'm not telling you anything. <laughs> you know what you were doing out there in that blood Can we just, I hate this. Why can't we just skip you it? Hindered. I eased their pain, reduced their suffering as best I could. <laughs> they were all around the civilians. People who picked up off the street who he suspected as having ties to terrorists. So you killed them. No, it's not something... He was inflicting terrible, unspeakable things. I couldn't let him keep doing that. Not to anyone. So I injected the succinylcholine instead of the sodium pentothal. Oh, good for you! But he found out. Yes, he Shit. found out, but Fuck no, I didn't kill him. Well, let's see. Uh, There's gotta be something here. Come on. Oh, wait. This is probably it. Uh, the game's having me try Your now. I hate it. He proved that the commander was killed by a lethal injection of succinylcholine. You injected him. As he was dying, he hit him over the head to finish him off. It wasn't like that. When he found out, he threatened me. Asked me if I wanted to trade places with one of the victims. <laughs> well, scared. that's dark. No shit. He came at me. I already had a syringe, so I injected him. But he was strong. He fought back. <laughs> hey, no crying. We can't afford to do that. <laughs> Uh, oh, now that she's crying, we have to stop. Nuh uh. Uh oh. She's on a mission. What the fuck is he doing? Sleeping? Goosh! What's the matter, Tony? Jet lag. Oh, caffeine crash. I don't know how the Gibbs man does it. And I really got a pee. Is his secret weapon? Count me out. I mean, I like coffee as much as the next guy, but Gibbs is inhuman. How much did you lose by? It doesn't Actually, matter he won by eight cups. He drank, he drank too meat, much. Okay. A lot. A whole lot. Like you're one to talk. You don't even drink real coffee. Okay, try and act tired. Like Alrighty. To I'm gonna act group. tired now. We'll Listen to how you know, sleepy There's actually more I caffeine am. in calf pow per ounce than in your typical cup of coffee. In fact, even with the latest coffee brewing technology, there is no way, either physical uh, or chemical, to squeeze that much caffeine out of a coffee bean. You'd have to artificially add caffeine to reach the same levels, and that's not even counting the ginseng, vitamin B, and other stimulants in Calf pal. So, how's your Very heart nice, uh, attacks, uh, so Abby? So, what are you saying? Oh, shit. Because that's like drinking saying you're the only one who can't today. hang with the boss. The big ones, too. See, I told you it was fucking Gibbs that threw it in Denozo's trash can. He just did it. Well, I guess. Wait, did we reach the end? We did. Woohoo! Okay. All right. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Way to go. Yeah. We got him. Yep. <clears throat> Fuck!